through two games. The Longhorns are a perfect 2-0, and and that's thanks in large part to a healthy Taylor Jones. Yeah, the veteran forward currently leads the team, averaging 16 points per game and ranks second in rebounds with 9.5 per contest. Recently, I got the chance to sit down with the Oregon State transfer, now in her second year on the 40, to chat about everything from expectations to her love of Zach Bryan to her fantastic Vic Schaefer impersonation. Three straight games in double-digit scoring for Taylor Jones. Taylor Jones with the stuff. All right, <laughs> here inside the Moody Center with Taylor Mother. Joe, <laughs> what is going on? What is going on? Let's, let's talk much. some hoops. Yeah. A little birdie tells me you've had a fantastic offseason. You missed nine games last year. Mm -hmm. What's motivating you healthy going into this year? I think it's an opportunity that I have. I mean, I hadn't been healthy for a, a really long time, just sort of trying to play whenever I could. And I think that just being as healthy as possible and pushing my body as much as I could in a healthy way. I'm super excited for this year because it's like I got to work in the off season more than I ever have. I know my potential for when I'm healthy and I'm excited to be able to like represent UT and try my best to play as best as I can. Just chatting with Vic, mm -hmm. he knows your potential this season too. Mm -hmm. He's really high on you being healthy, one of the veteran leaders hearing that from your head coach, mm -hmm. who's seen you go through the ebbs and flows of injuries healthy, injuries mm -hmm. healthy. That's gotta be pretty special. It is, it's um, nice to have, like to hear those words and to hear that he believes in me and can see the potential that I have. Um, and I think that he just saw not only my hard work this off season, but our whole team. Early exit from the tournament last year. Yeah. But I really think that Texas women's basketball. It is a big time program, mm -hmm. but I almost feel like you ladies are one big sleeping giant right now, ready to pounce on the rest of the league. Do you mm -hmm. feel that same way? I think we learned last year that rankings at this time of the year don't matter. I mean, we started out at three and we're not there. We well, were not there. So many injuries started last season. <laughs> yeah. Right? Yeah. And so I just know the potential of our team and I'm excited for everyone else to be able to see that. It'll be a fun journey whenever we finally get to get out there and start playing. And so we can finally erase what happened. Good work. One, two, three. Good work. Also talking with you off camera before we got into this, mm -hmm. Zach Bryan, yeah. the music. Uh -huh. How much fun have you been having going to his concerts and then is he on the pregame playlist? His music doesn't really gear towards that. Yeah. Do you maybe go a little mellow? Um, I wouldn't say like I listen to him before games, but every other day I do. I mean, I started listening to him a few years back whenever he was still small and now he's just completely blown up. And I mean, I sort of saw it coming, but I think it's cool to, me and Shay are really like, we both love him and we both, although we weren't at the same schools, like we both were listening to him whenever he was like smaller. And just being able to say like, no, we're a super fan. Like you don't get to call yourself a super fan. We are. Beautiful job by Taylor Jones to keep that ball. Favorite Vic is, okay? He says all these things uh -huh. that come out of his mouth and I'm like, I don't know where he comes up with mm -hmm. this stuff. Do you have a favorite Vic ism? So I'm from Texas and like my family is from like middle of nowhere, Texas. And so they all have like the super Southern accent, say all the phrases that like, everyone's like grandma used to say. Proof, and proof is in the pudding. Yes, exactly, that one. And <laughs> Coach Schaefer actually did tell me that on my visit. He was like, proof is in the pudding, sweetie. You gotta come here. <laughs> just look at what I've done. Proof is in the pudding. I just think the proof's in the pudding, y'all. Like you probably said it like 10 times. And whenever he's mad in practice, and he'll say some like super Southern phrase that like my grandma or grandpa probably used to say. They're really fun to be around, but it's hard to have fun when you're getting your butt beat. And he's really mad at us. And like, I just cannot help but like to just laugh in my head. I don't do it like out loud, but I'm like, that was funny. I was gonna ask you for your best Vic impersonation, but you've already provided that yeah. for us. I don't even proof's have to in ask the pudding. that. Proof is in the pudding. Yeah. And the proof is in Taylor Jones. Good luck this season. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, hook em. Taylor Jones, just an awesome young lady, wishing her all the best this season. Again, leading the team right now through two games, 16 points per game. She and the Longhorns back home Tuesday night when they host UT Arlington.
Mm, I love that. The proof is in the pudding. Proof is in the pudding. Honey. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> All right.